Okay, to start, because her face is young and we're in the winter, I'm going to use the Gergens um, Ultra Healing, and this is for extra dry skin. Um, so I'm just going to use a little bit on her face. And starting on, since we already started with her face, my hands are clean, by the way. I'm going to ask her a few questions so you guys can get to know my niece a little bit more um, in detail. She hasn't been in my channel, like she hasn't been properly presented in my channel. I have done my nephew's makeup a long, long time vi video ago. Like if you guys want to go check that video out, you guys can. It's definitely in my somewhere in youtube um and yeah so once her crema cream is blended up we're gonna move into foundation and the first question i have you sell is how old are you 10 okay and what is your background can you let the youtuber people know what's in the background mm, like your roots I'm using, by the way, I'm using the Born This Way foundation, and I'm using a like, little cute little egg, but yeah, like your mom and dad are from Honduras, Honduras, but she was born here, guys. Okay, so what about your favorite color? Uh, yellow. Yellow. You like yellow? Really? Yeah. I thought you were, I thought you were more like a pink girl, like pink. No, I don't like pink, but I do have lots of things that are pink because my mom likes to dress me pink. So if I want something, I can't have it unless it's pink. Because <laughs> normally pink is for girls, so I guess that's what mommy is thinking. Um, I'm just blending her foundation. I didn't put no primer on because her skin doesn't really need, in my opinion, it's very healthy and she doesn't really need like um like no type of primer and I'm just putting a little bit of foundation because as well her skin is very smooth so she doesn't need as much foundation required okay so the next question is what is your favorite drink uh I like Pepsi you like Pepsi you like she's a soda drinker yes how old are you? You already asked that question. I did ask? Oh, I'm sorry. Did I? In the beginning. Oh, okay. Sorry. I'm getting confused with the makeup and everything. Okay. So what else should we let the people know? So you go to school, and what grade do you go to? Fifth. Fifth grade. Oh my god, you're getting so big. Okay, so I'm putting some concealer. And it's cover FX, and I'm just um, adding a tiny little bit on the um, sponge because this is very thick, and I don't want, she doesn't really need a lot. So, can you look up for me, please? Okay. So, I want to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. In case of a fire, what would you do? Who you would save, your mom or your brother? Um... I know that's a hard question because yes. I think if I asked that, I think I wouldn't be able to answer. I guess my mom because, I mean, a brother is, it's hard to replace because it's hard to get used to, but also your mom is kind of a little bit more important. Because she, she takes care yeah, of you. And she is an old, and since my brother is not old enough to really take care of me, then look up. Mm -hmm. so then it's, it's more of a mom situation. Yeah. So I would say my mom. I th uh, yeah. I wouldn't be able to answer that question, honestly, if I'm asked. If I'm asked to choose, I, I think I won't be able to answer. I think I'll say I'll stay with them. Because <laughs> it's, it's, it's a difficult question when you're put in that precision. So once her concealer is blended... I'm going to wait for that to dry before I set it. She does have some little red spots here. Um, she probably got like little bruises, but it's fine. They're scratches. All the scratches. So once I'm done with that, I'm going to try to um, 
do something with the eyebrows. She does. She's very young to pluck her eyebrows, so she doesn't pluck her eyebrows yet. But I'm gonna use the Cara brow dip with this angle. Um, I think it's Wet and Wild brush, and that's what we're gonna be doing to maybe define her eyebrows a little bit more. This is like a pasty, hard pasty thing. Consistency. Consistency. There we go. She's correcting me, guys. She should be a teacher, though. I don't mind correction because that means I learn even more and perfect my English. Okay. I'm trying my best to make her look as natural but also like that you can tell that she's wearing makeup she got cute eyebrows though when she's on the age to pluck her eyebrows like they're gonna be perfect eyebrows look at that <laughs> okay another question who out of all your uncles and aunts who's your favorite one you <laughs> and why is that because um, I only have, like, I have three uncles, and you're my only aunt well, mm -hmm. on my mom's side. And I don't really know my my dad's side on um, aunt. A lot? Yeah. Mm -hmm. I only know her, like, that her hair is kind of ginger and stuff. <laughs> so, I have, you know, I have met your aunt before in, in Honduras, right? But I only saw her from distance. Oh. Because you have an aunt from your father's side in Honduras. And I met her, but only for this. And she was very chunky. <laughs> yeah. Let me see how that looks. Okay. I'm trying to fix it as much as I can, guys. Don't judge me. Her eyebrows are, like, very all over the place. Okay. I think we got it. Okay, so I guess I'm the favorite aunt. <laughs> I do feel, I guess, some type of way because, yeah, I should be their favorite aunt. Okay, guys, so once I conceal kind of like her eyelids um, with the foundation, and I kind of like clean out the bottom of her eyebrows so they can look a little more defined, um, and now that everything is dry, what I'm going to do is I'm going to set underneath her eyes and underneath the eyebrows with this, um, Clinique powder and it's natural fair. It's my favorite. As you guys can tell, I hit pan already. I love it. It's just perfect. It does his, his job and yeah, I love it. So I'm going to go with a small brush because she has like small eyes <laughs> so i'm gonna go underneath her eyes with this little tiny brush so you can look up and moving on to other questions would you prefer wearing a dress pants shirt shorts a shirt or whatever else other fashion is out there what do you prefer to wear uh well, like on a casual time well most people would have said like pants or shorts uh -huh. or most girls would have said a dress but since you gave me uh my uh, my own answer yeah so i would pick black leggings and a hoodie because <laughs> it's it's comfortable and you can do so many things in them because they're like stretchy yeah Unlike jeans and shorts, they, they don't stretch as much. Mm -hmm. They're more, like, tight. It's kind of like, I prefer sweatpants and a t-shirt. Like, if I can get away with wearing sweatpants and a t-shirt and my hair up with no makeup everywhere, I will do, do that. But it's just, yeah, it's not possible. So, yeah. Unless you get judged. Uh-huh, exactly. So, I'm going to go in with the, um... Bronzer Too Faced Beach Bunny, um, which it looks like this, and I'm going to start contouring her face just a little bit because she doesn't really need much, 
and I'm gonna go in with the Sephora um, kind of like flat brush to do that and then I'm gonna ask her to do a duckling face there we go she's like why do I have to do these ridiculous things for my aunt because you love me <laughs> And then we're going to contour a little bit her forehead and we're going to bring it down along the hairlines. And a little bit like that. And her nose, I'm going to kind of squish the, the, the brush to contour her nose. And then I'm going to go move her hair underneath right here, the um, chin bone and go in there and kind of create a shadow so her face looks a little thinner. Okay, we're gonna do the same thing on the other side. Okay, once we got her contour in, we're gonna bake with the same powder, but this time I'm gonna use the little wet sponge, wet beauty blender, and I'm gonna ask her to do the ducky face again, and we're gonna kind of just bake so it can look smoother. And then once we're done, we will brush it off because I'm gonna start right away with the eyes. And yeah. Okay. Now that we're done with that, uh, I'm going to ask yourself what does she like to watch? Like, what's her favorite um, TV show? And meanwhile, she's thinking of the answer. I'm going to be using the In the Bomb of Your Hand eyeshadow palette and it looks like that and this is what i'm gonna be using to work on her face and everything else while you while she's doing that i'll be working on her eyes um my favorite tv show at the moment is nailed it because it's really interesting how some people can come up with something amazing even though they don't know how to do that one thing so let's say if i never baked the cake before or if i tried and failed some people in that show have tried and failed but then when they cook they like somehow succeed and get lucky and win and it's really fun seeing people being so happy and trying you like they all that i used to watch that tv show a lot they made another season yeah i have to watch the new season I just think it's crazy how they come up with all these ideas and you have to kind of like compare them. Yeah. But I'm. I it's funny. Like it's funny. Big grown up shows. Because the little kid grown up shows are like, oh, do you know where the mountain is? Yeah. Point to the mountain. <laughs> and it kind of just starts getting really dumb after that. Right. Okay, so what I did is I pretty much contour a little bit her eyes with the natural pink right here. And then I'm going to go in and place this on her lids and darken it up a little bit with this one. So that's what I'm doing. So, yeah. I'm doing a very natural look on her because obviously she's young. I forgot her age. <laughs> to be honest, <laughs> so I just said she's young. You're, are you 10 or 11? 10. I'm about to turn 11. That's yeah, 10. that's why I got kind of confused. I'm like, is she 11 or 10? Or 12? <laughs> or 13? How old is she? More than 13. And I'm like a freaking... And I'm his her favorite one. <laughs> and don't know her age. That I sucks. Said, this might sound bad. <laughs> what? I forgot your age. I'm 22. No, I thought you were 21. So. 
I wish. I really wish I'll be 21 still. Um. Yeah, so we're done with that. And I'm going to go with a smaller brush, which is this cutie patootie brush right here. And I'm going to... Cutie Yeah, I love this little brush. And I'm just going to use the darker brown. Close your eyes. Just to darken the edges a little bit of the top color. Do you guys see that? That's turning out so beautiful. I feel so grown up right now. Okay, close your eyes. I know. Because it's like a very natural color, but I think this is the eye look I will wear for like a very smooth event. I would like say going to a park or something. No, like <laughs> going out for ch maybe church or dinner. I was about to say dinner, but then I was like, oh, that's a little too mm, classic. Yeah. Okay. And because I use the dark color, I will have to go in again with the that flat brush and just clean out the clear color your stomach her stomach just rumble if you guys hear it in the video comment <laughs> her stomach rumble she's not hungry though because she just ate we just ate chitarones it's a soda oh it's the soda it's the soda soda shush money wait can i drink okay. hold on hold on and i'm adding that little white color on the top of her brow bone i'm gonna have a bone in my yeah, this one right here. I didn't even know. Just to give it a little shizzle. You guys see that? Okay. Okay. Um, for her cheeks blush, I'm gonna use the NYX palette, and I'm gonna use actually like maybe this one mixed with this one right here, so she can have like a very youth look. And I'm going to use one of the Wet n Wild Angle Brush. And I'm just going to place it on her cheeks. Can you go like this, like smile? So I can see your cheekbones? Yeah. On her cheekbones. And then drag it out. Okay, we're going to do the same one right here. Look at me. Okay. Okay. And for highlight, I'm going to go in with the Madison Miller palette. And it looks like that. And I'm going to use this one right here to highlight her face. And I'm going to use this brush right here. I'm going to highlight her face. This video is going to be like 20 minutes long. So far it's 11. Yeah, but the other minutes that we... <laughs> this is why I don't like to do a lot of talk-throughs videos, but I wanted to do something different because I always do like the fast record of the videos and I normally, you know, don't talk because I know that those videos take very long. But I, I think... I wanted you guys to know Yisel. <laughs> Yisel. Her name is actually Giselle, but say it. Giselle. Yisel. But I say Yisel just to bother her. It doesn't bother me. Oh, okay. <laughs> well, out of love then. You say it out of love. Or just to make fun of me. <laughs> yeah, or just to make fun of her. <sighs> okay, so we're going to blend everything out. Um, remember, we have the powder down here and a powder down here. First, I'm going to brush that off like so and that off, okay? And then I'm going to use that Essence powder 
and we're gonna go in. You don't have to make this up. <laughs> you guys don't like it you guys are gonna hear me saying Shh, like a freaking like a switch switchers are you saying that swiffers uh -huh, swiffers <laughs> Señor Cepillo. Shh, shh. there we go Ooh, that looks spicy let me look at you right here because i think i wipe over a little too much there we go Ooh, look at you look at you okay guys so we're getting to the moment of the mascara if i can't find it i will be using the roller lash uh, mascara on her eyelids eyelids lashes lashes get it together eliza um just to is that a sample yeah it's a sample i got it actually in my ipsy box um I can leave. I don't. I forgot, but it's actually really good. And I don't buy mascara because I get a lot of examples from the. Oh, Giselle, no, you blink. Because you went in my eye. We will have to clean that up. <laughs> no, 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 no! Don't close your she eyes. No, stop, stop, stop! Yeah. <laughs> She hit my eye. Hey guys, we're back. I had to stop because I had to fix all the mess that we made. Close your eyes. So I'm just fixing all the, you know, everything that got messed up with the whole situation. Okay, so once that's fixed, I'm going to move in. Well, move, we have bloopers Move now. Guy, again with... um. Anyway, I'm gonna be very loose. Because now your eyelashes go. Okay, okay. We got it. Not the other one. Don't don't blink though, okay? Because then we're gonna get mascara. She has very sensitive eyes. Yeah. She's not used to the makeup, so like her eyes are being very sensitive right now. So I'm being kind of gentle. Open. Okay, we're done with the mascara. Okay, so the next question is, what animal do you like? Because I know we forgot about the questions the questions once we you know did the whole situation thing <laughs> um i really like cats but i also like guinea pigs but i wouldn't get a guinea pig nor a cat because then for a while they start smelling really bad so i'm good but i really do love snakes and I she also snakes. likes snakes. Um, Maybe a snake in the future would be a good idea. I really love snakes. I hope, like, to, one time my mom took me to a boat to see the Statue of Liberty, and there was a guy who was letting you hold a snake around your neck. And I asked my mom if I could hold one. Well, she forced me to hold it. I didn't ask her. But she let me hold it. And then from that day on, I fell in love with snakes. I, I was there with you, yes. and I didn't have the guts to hold that snake. I wanted to, but I said no. I kind of wanted to hold the big yellow one, but I had to yeah. hold the, the little, little one. one. I, yeah, I wanted to hold the yellow one. Going in, we're going to go with the Belle and Argent. And it's a scary red, but I'm just going to tap some in her lips, and then I'm going to tap it out. Because this is going to leave like a very nice pink color in her lips and she doesn't need a lot of color she's a beautiful girl just how she is um so that's what we're gonna do like if you guys see it this is a beautiful gloss guys like just like that like you guys can see how red it is and it's beautiful but because it's for her what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna add that and then i'm gonna start tapping it on her lips and spreading it
my daughter loves this little lipstick she lets me put it in her mouth just how i'm adding it to her and she's like one and a half and she like sits next to me and she grabs the brushes and she literally goes while i'm doing my makeup every time i'm getting ready for school and i know that she's gonna love makeup too just like her mommy <laughs> loves makeup let me see right here okay I, I close your mouth say that i love makeup but i don't know how to do this and i mess up okay so this is her ending look guys please give us a comment down below Give it a like. Subscribe, subscribe to the channel because it really helps the channel grow. And yeah, if you guys like this little chit chat, getting to know me a little more and getting to know Yisel a little bit more, which she's my niece. She's one of my oldest niece I have. I have two nephews that I know of and I have two nieces. One is, she's small. She's like two she's three. about oh she's about to be three i forgot oh my gosh she has jaden's age that's true she's about to be four actually on may um so yeah i have two nieces so she's very small and then i have her which is she's my oldest and yeah i think and who's i think i see more often because my other niece i really don't see her as often as i wish but they travel to the train by themselves just to come and see auntie so you know that's a big thing to me and yeah leave a comment down below if you guys this this look <laughs> um yeah send them a kiss